Today we're going to be unboxing the Q-Collar. Now if you guys haven't seen this short yet where we talk about what the Q-Collar is, I highly suggest you go check that out first. We talk about who wears the Q-Collar and what it exactly does. So on the seat you can see it's made by Q30. On the back it does say Q-Collar helps protect the brain from repetitive subconcussive head impacts. When you open this box up you do get a carrying case. We have a code on the back which helps you get the sizing right and make sure you're wearing it properly around your neck. They stress that a ton that you need to wear it properly. Now in the case you have a couple things. You have the Q-Collar. You also have the measuring tool to make sure it's not too tight around your neck. And then you have this little sleeve where you could put a sleeve in there as well. Looking at the outside, it's kind of like this plastic rubbery material. It has a little bit of like a texture to it. It says Q30, that's the manufacturer, and Q-Collar is the product. The two main materials are going to be a rubber and then a plastic on the inside. This is the measuring tool to make sure it's not too tight around your neck. See, you want it in that green. Next, we have the sleeve. You can put this over top of it if you want more of a fabric feel. Most commonly worn by Dalton Schultz. Now, this does take a little bit to get over top of this thing. It's really hard because it is a really tight fit on here. It took me a while to get on, and once I put it on, I actually realized I had it upside down, but I'm not going back. I'm leaving it that way. 